Right now at 5, a pursuit that went to the dogs. You saw it live on our sister station, KCAL 9, last night. A driver opened the door, and half a dozen dogs ran out onto the freeway. Welcome back, everybody, to CBS News at 5. I'm Paul Majors. And I'm Pat Harvey. Officers and dog catchers eventually corral the canines. CBS 2's Christy Fajardo shows us what happens to the dogs now. A pooch pursuit on the 710 freeway. Officers found themselves corralling six of the friendliest suspects they've encountered. The culmination of a bizarre chase that started when officers say they stopped to help what they thought was a stranded driver. Here we go again. It then ended like with a pit maneuver. Trying to get those dogs under control. And the pit bull mixes getting loose. They appear to be bright, alert, and responsive um, and of good temperament. Today, the dogs were still wagging their tails at Long Beach Animal Care Services. We visited the three adult females and three puppies who were about four months old. They clearly liked people. We're going to keep them safe. Um, we'll keep them clean and healthy and, and fed and uh, just take care of them until we can identify the owner. A loved one who didn't want to be identified said this woman, 47 year old Tiffany Toby, is their owner. He calls her a dog collector and says she often acts erratically. On Twitter, we found accounts under the Toby name with photos of other pooches. La Habra, where she lives, has a four dog limit, which means some of her dogs may have to be put up for adoption. The CHP says Toby isn't facing charges related to the pups, but was arrested for felony evading and DUI. In Long Beach, Christy Fajardo, CBS 2 News.